What's up guys? Today is Monday. There's Mr. Joe. Y'all know what day it is. Obviously we're in the studio, so that means Joe's still afoot. But he's got some stuff today, so let's take a look, see what he's got. You guys, come on. guys, how you doing? I hope you all had a great weekend. Um, I know I had a pretty good weekend. Um, my leg's pretty sore yet from my surgery, and I go in tomorrow for my other leg, so go figure on that, but uh, sooner it gets done, sooner I get better, and uh, it's all going to be good. There you go, so, back to normal. A little, little apprehensive on that, but yeah, back to normal. Normal, that's, that's a state of mind somewhere. Um, <laughs> So, I got my new shirts, and you know, I go to put my, my phone in my pocket, and they sew this in for the, yeah, for the for this, thing on, yeah. it don't fit, it's like, what the heck, and so I'm going to learn how to put my <laughs> phone in my other, yeah. because I brought like four of these, it's like, come on, but, uh, so, you know, those little, little things, yep. but we're going to start with the bucket of cash, Okay. only because, um, well, I got one of my guys from Friday, because all of a sudden, one day, you know, a couple of weeks ago, he uh, discovered discovered the show, and, you know, so he was getting other people at the shop there to see it and watch it, and so he was paying, and I was getting ready to put his uh, money in the bucket of cash, and he goes, you know, Joe, I watch you every Monday now, and I go, okay, Woody, and I, I was getting the, uh, the drift, so, Mr. Woody, I know... Uh, and then I said to him, I says, would you, like to meet, would you like to see and hear me say, Mr. Woody, we got two for you for the bucket of cash. There you of go. Of course, he sees us go in, you know, on Fridays, but um, here's a shout out for you. So, there you go. Um, cool. We got Mr. Al in my hand. We have Mr. Junior Switcher. I got my good buddy, and uh, we're just going to use his first name because he doesn't like him being out there on social media and stuff. But uh, from my hometown, uh, Savant, um, somewhere, his name's Will. Okay. So, Mr. Will, we got you in here. We'll kind of keep you on the low side. Now, Mr. Bob Bates. Yep. Mr. Bob Bates. We see we got a pile here. So I'm going to say his name a few times because there is one, two, three, four, five, Mr. Bob Bates, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, Mr. Bob Bates. Wow. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Ooh. So, um, that's a lot of money. No, I, uh, it's hard to catch up to that man. It's hard to keep up with that man. But uh, <laughs> a great guy. He sent me a picture. So one day I sent him, as you can see why, I sent him uh, one of my Joe's All-Star hats, you know, for his thing. And, and in his trophy collection, and it, you know, when I remember when we did the picture of yeah. his office, he says, look at my, uh, my newest, latest addition to my trophy collection. And right there in the middle up on the top there was one of, was my Joe's all-star hat, so. Uh, <laughs> well, you know what's cool? He, 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 made, he made me smile and happy. That here. jersey, the Blackhawks jersey? Yes. Mr. Robert Bates sent me that, and this Blackhawk jersey, Mr. Robert Bates sent me that one. And this one's really cool, because it's a 2009 Winter Edition, or Winter Classic, where they play at Wrigley Field, so. All right, see? He, uh, he was kind of nice. He's seen that I liked all the sports stuff, and Mr. he's like, hey, I'm going to send you something cool. So one heck of he a did. man, let me tell you. Yep. And uh, if you need a shirt off his back, I don't think he'd hesitate one moment to give it to you. Yeah, he's a great guy. Um, yeah, he's a great man. So I look forward to my next trip going up and back and getting a chance to meet him again because that's on my uh, GPS. It's always a... Uh, Stop. Yeah. Well, guess what? I'm going to see him next week 
we're going to eat dinner while I'm in town, so oh. I'm going to get there before you do. Huh? Lucky you. <laughs> Lucky you. There we go. All right. So we got some tools, looks like. All right. Let's talk some tools. I got an Astro Digital yeah. Tire Inflator. Astro's a great company. Um, carries a year warranty on it. Uh, usually these hold up far better in a year. I got seven of them out there four or five years and they're still running strong. Right. Um, sometimes you need to replace a battery. Imagine mm -hmm. that. Uh, I got them sell for 120. 120. So there's what it looks like, guys. Yeah, all nice, clean, and pretty. Oh, that's a handy set right there. We have that's the a Lyle wild kit too. That's a good one. AC fuel disconnect set. Yep, that's a great kit right there. It's got so all the basic fundamental stuff you need. You got the comes right off the bar the straight ones. You got the angled Angles. ones. Yep. Bring on the angled doohickeys. Mm -hmm. You got the split ones, piece ones. It's all there. That's I have this here set. for sixty-eight bucks. Sixty-eight dollars. You know what's bad? I think that's what I paid, or pretty close to that, when I bought that set off the Matco truck. You know why? Because it's got Matco wrote on it. And who makes all of them? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> They don't make anything, they put their name on it, and then you pay for that. Oh, yeah. But a Mayhew hose clamp player set. Mayhew's a good company. Mayhew good is uh, company. very good stuff. These are 89 bucks. 89 bucks. And for those of you that don't know what these are, you put this like down on the bottom radiator hose, you can clamp it on, and you squeeze it with the plier part. It's called a remote access hose clamp yep. plier. Whatever you want to call it. It locks it in place. Locks you can it let down, go. And that way... You can get into hard to reach areas with a hose Slide plant. the hose off, it still stays in an in a open position. When you get ready to put it together, put it all back on, release yep. it, and it's Super just Super like handy you, thing to have. So. I did not know that Mayhew made a set of those. You taught me something today. Yes, they do, and they're very good. And then I carried all this in here in this uh, gear wrench uh, tote. Tote. which has all kinds of compartments inside it's got the carry strap metal handle That's really nice. hard Solid carry bottom. plastic which is kind of nice versus the cloth ones if you spill something inside here it's yeah. easy to clean it doesn't destroy it it's um, really nice right i there. have these for 62 bucks and you got pockets all the way around somebody asked what's the velcro for I says, well, put your hand right here. He puts his hand there, and I velcro his hand to it. I go, that's for people with the hands there in the wrong place. Like a long tool, you could put it all the way across the box. Yes. And bam, there you go. That's so, really nice, Joe. So good, good I hope you guys today. have a great week. Um, I look forward to seeing you all soon. Um, oh. Thanks, Mr. Fred. There was one of my stops in Corinth. I walk in the shop, and the owner was busy working with another guy. I walk, walking out, and all of a sudden I hear, Oh, wait, Mr. Joe All-Star Tools. <laughs> I stop. I turn around. He says, I watch you all the time. He says, but you never come out to my shop. And I go, yeah, I don't know where your shop is. He says, don't worry about it. It's so far out in the nowhere's land. He says, we're just now getting first runs of hee-haw. <laughs> And I said, oh, my gosh. And I, we talked a little bit, you know, great guy. And uh, so we talked a little bit, and then I said, just a minute. So I ran out to my car and my car truck, my car truck, because Ford has no idea whenever I'm going to get a, a truck. Right. I, I really hate even discussing that. But anyways, so I ran out there, and I got him one of my pocket pry bars, and I really don't do this, but I gave him one of them. And he's like, he says, well, what did I give you? I, I says, no, I says, you're too far away from me. I says, just, that's yours. <laughs> he says, well, holy crap. He says, well, if I ever order something from you, I'll order it from you. I said, I said well, if you order something from me, I'll make sure it gets on that horse and buggy and I, it can go. get it shipped to you. Get it shipped and to you. And he, he just bust out <laughs> laughing. So, um, that's cool. 
you never know when you turn around, somebody's just going to be really nice and, you know, yeah. it's just a great day. So That's true. I hope you all have just a great day as well. All right, guys, like always, if you need anything from Mr. Joe, his number is right down here at 731-412-7295. Shoot him a text and he'll get back with you. Like always, guys, thanks for hanging out with us on this awesome, rainy, wet Monday that we're having. we got some more storms coming, so it's going to be a beautiful night. Like always, guys, hit the thumbs up. It's totally free. It never costs you a penny to press that button, so there's no excuse for you not to do it. And check over here for merchandise. Cool tools and discount codes is in the description. And if you're not subscribed, this is the easiest thing you can do. You can take your finger and press the button. It don't cost anything. Press that button. You guys have a great week, and we will catch you next time. See ya. Click, click.